In a previous video, we played a character called Tainted David that lost 8% of his stats every floor. Today, we're gonna try out Normal David. Getting hit causes him to lose 2% offensive stats. Beating the floor's boss gives a 7% stat bonus, though. The worse I play, the worse I'll do. We start off with a, whoa, nice. I swear to God, editor can back me up on this. This is not seated. I did not press the restart button. Durham recharge, slingshot. That's a percentage of uh, boss health if you fight a boss with it. You know, whole David and Goliath thing. Killing champions will, okay, are there any enemies here? Killing champions spawn, there are no enemies. Hello? I'm all alone. 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 Alone! Jesus, Tim is still here. My God, an enemy. It's happening. Give me a bomb, please. You gave me everything but. All right, let's try this slingshot. Wham. Yeah. Kind of cool, I guess. I really don't want to get hit here. This is an easy boss to get hit on. It's so quick. Uh, this. No, no, no! Oh, come on! This is why there were no enemies on the first floor. Holy moly. No, hey. Stop it! Holy crap! Oh, we got some stats back. Net positive, if I might add. Wow, we're really good at this game. Hey, can I get like six bombs? That's a no, I think. I don't know, self damage counts. I'm, I'm hoping that it does not count. Like if I go into my curse room right now, are we gonna be punished? Self damage does not count. Thank you, thank you. I'd be flipping furious. You imagine every time you use a blood donation machine, you lose stats. Blood donation machines and shops are my bread and butter. All right, a lot of fun stuff we couldn't do. Would that be insane? Would that be insane to go alt path right now? You want me to, don't even lie to me. Slingshot, go! Yeah, I have to add that I think the slingshot sucks. Ah! The RNG, the just the flipping RNG on these alt floors. The blasts like that, the, the rain falling from above, the rocks falling from above in the mines. God, I hate that so much. Like you just can't take damage ever, 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 ever if you want to be a good Isaac player. But the randomness that they add in is just, oh my gosh. Roll the die, sometimes you're just gonna lose. Item room, help me. Holy water, I think holy water is really good. Completely underrated. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take it. And we, oh, I hate this game, I hate it. Why are we playing this? I'm back under base stats again. Uh-oh, uh-oh, these things too. Why did I go alt path? Don't even lie to me. You guys also hate the alt path. You just want to see me suffer. It's obvious. Holy water, go. Watch me get nothing but flying bosses for the rest of the game. So holy water won't do anything. Min Min. Not fully understanding the use here of the slingshot. It said something about bouncing around the room, so I thought like it might bounce between the wall and the boss and you'd be able to do more damage, like in Gungeon. It just seems like it's bad. It applies weakness to normal enemies, which like could be a cool thing in a tight space. No, oh, oh, eh, oh. I don't know how I didn't get hit there. It's gonna go like this. Got some more stats. We're back up above base again. That face is correct. That is how I feel on the inside. It's a secret room and there's a tempted rock. I don't know if I'll be able to get both, but I'm gonna try. He's the best player in the world. Gosh, this game is so fun. <laughs> All right. You know what? I could bomb through to my curse room. Yay. No soul heart for me, so let's go buy one. Ugh. Not only is this an extremely punishing character, but wow. This has got to be one of my worst starts I've ever seen in like the past hundred runs. And we started with Wafer. Of course, we don't notice the effects of Wafer until we actually fight like a champion or get to the womb, so. Amazing. Oh, ooh, ah, ah! What do you actually expect me to do in a situation like that? What would you like me to do in a room like this? Back down to base damage. And we lost our devil chance. I just, look, I don't know. It's the whole reason why we're here on the alt path. It's completely rigged. Entering the third floor without even having seen a soul heart? That's unheard of. There's a lot of stuff in there. Shit about that ladder. Hey, how about a soul heart for sale? Smelter could be good. Let's see if we can't find some cash. That is some cash. 
Item room's got... Yeah, well... I don't think it's very good on this floor, but 120 volt is amazing. Goodbye, spider butt. That's... Good trade. Getting close to anybody here. <laughs> Come on, shots. I just dodged right there. What say you, curse room? Guppy's collar. Pills. More pills. Hematemesis. That's fine. 48. Okay, another hematemesis. And... Shot speed up. Secret room. Not much going on. Using my excellent skills. I can just feel the top secret room being there. <laughs> Using my even more expert skills. Obviously, anyone with more than three brain cells can see that the top secret room is right here. Uh huh. Mmm. Soul heart? Oh, we have angel precedence now. If we can keep it alive, wormwood. Pretty straightforward, but depending on the arena, can really sneak up on you. Oh, holy water. That was good. That was really good. This is why we like you. Tight arena. Tight arena. We got him. No angel. No. Soul hearts though, and a health upgrade. I am very happy about that. Now, you know what? PJ's gives you full health too. Shoot. I should have spent it on the machine up here. I could have held off on picking up PJ's and I could have went after the hematemesis pill, which could have allowed me a lot more plays as well. Well, we tried. You know what? We need a miracle here. Let's do the flip side. Oh, I can get all this stuff with the flight too. Oh, I forgot. Hey, what about this though? Use my holy mantle to get into that room and get the hematemesis. Genius. I'll cross, oh, I'll get the money first. It's enough money to do the thing. And I think I'm gonna do the thing. I think doing the thing is gonna be really nice for us. All right. Oh, it's this room. I forgot about this room. We handle it much better. All right, one room with a battle. Then we'll cross over, turn back into our normal form. I'm gonna do every little cheatsy doodling thing that I can possibly think of here. We need it. Well, we got one soul art. Back to the flip. All right, Wormwood. I got my devil card for this side. Even better. Holy water, you do your thing. Oh my god, it's good. Give me that lunch. We really need DPS though, sorely. Would I collect the knife? Yeah, I do think I want to go to chest in this run because this run is sucking a whole lot of butt. Hey, it's our first mini Zack from a champion kill. All right, look at my health. I'm feeling better already. Good enough to get slaughtered in the mines. Curse of the blind. Oh boy. Really need some, okay, ow. First room's already pretty fricked. Okay, okay, okay! Pretty much back down to base damage. God, that pisses me off. Curse room. Got turds. Ooh, okay. Blind shop item, go. Yeah, hey! That's great. The battery, actually? I think I would like to take the battery. Double charge smelt sounds pretty cool. Mm-hmm. These guys, whose name I totally remember. Tough twins, flying dudes. They went down really hard, wow. Oh my God, is that a deal with the devil? Oh my God, is that a consolation prize? It's probably gonna give me something stupid like range. Speed. Well, <laughs> the last challenge that I had, I turned into Dark Judas and everyone got mad. I love it when everyone gets mad. No, I'm <laughs> Would I say no to the smell to take a satanic Bible? It might be run defining. Honestly, the dark arts could be an okay thing for us to take as well. But I'm gonna try the satanic Bible. The smelt is amazing, but uh, I, I need some DPS items. So more deals with the devil sound good. For those of you that don't know, it's a black heart on use, and on the floor that you use it on, the boss item will be replaced by a devil deal, or blood price, or soul heart price. Now you're gonna give me trinkets? Sure. Item room. Decap attack. That's a no. Let's say you random. Serpent's kiss. Probably not gonna be touching people, but occasional poison shot, that sounds okay. One of these curse rooms is gonna give me what I need. 
Oh, God. Tim, I see you in there. I need whatever you got. Maybe small rock? I'm back down to 393 damage. Reap creep. Can I zap him from here? Oh, nice. Oh, the dodges. Let's go. The laser part. The toughest part. Oh, God, I hate that. You gotta, like, just stand off the center. If it takes just a little bit too long to frickin' fire his laser, then he shoots out to the side. It's just, I hate to... Devil deal. We got it anyways for a little brim. Did we use a satanic Bible on this floor? We must not have because I got a magical scab. Sweet. Freaking sweet, dude. Gosh, I feel horrible about this run. I'm just, I'm really not trying to throw this. I obviously didn't use my satanic Bible yet because I didn't need the health. But then we did the boss like kind of early and uh, didn't get to cash in on that devil deal item. Which, you know, was kind of the whole point. Item room. <laughs> Honestly, might be a good thing. Because my speed is fine, but everything else is pretty crap. I'm gonna try it. So long, piercing. But now we have more fire rate, more damage. Hive mind, whatever this card is, two of hearts, that's not helpful. Get a reroll. Hive mind's great, but we're not generating flies. Pale mimic? No. Humbling grundle and a damage upgrade gone. And we got restock. This feels like one of those runs that's just gonna go poorly for the sake of going poorly. Hey, my promised crown, I got it back. Am I gonna get even more mini Zacks by holding two of these? Do they stack? At least the knife will be good, right? I hate this part. Not sure I've seen this layout yet. What do I do here? Shoot that. And that. Is this just a flight card? <laughs> I want the card. Give me the card! Totally was a flight card. Was it worth it? No. Go, 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 go. Back to the normal path, please. I feel nothing but regret going all path. Nothing but regret for every single one of my stupid curse rooms, too. We're gonna be relying on my passive damage. Oh, good shot. Something I didn't think about with taking Libra is that every single time we get offensive stat down, it's now going to decrease my speed as well. And if we take enough damage, we could be so slow that we'll just lose. This is, uh, it's quite the interesting run. And I do think it can go either way. Uh, oh, Joker card, I like that. Last item room, euthanasia. I don't hate it. Oh, I hate this turret, I hate these turrets. These uh, little quad shooting turrets make repentance, I would say, about twice as hard as Afterbirth Plus. These and the triple shot turrets make the game so much harder. There really needs to be like an item or a trinket in the game that just turns off all turrets. Of course, Euthanasia is one of the rare items that can destroy turrets. So maybe we should have used that. Keybagger, what say you? He's like, you want my dirty underwear? My gamer cat e-girl used sweaty underwear? Hell yeah. It's an all stats up, baby. Thanks, Libra. You have more? Yeah, you do. What's in our shop today? That would be mom's bracklet. Counterfeit penny. Yeah, it's too little too late for you. Mom's foot. Time for some feet picks. Hold still, hold still. Nice. Polaroid, let's use our Joker card. Take some Gimpy. Use Plan C. No, I'm not gonna do that. Boom one, six damage, four fire rate. You don't think I got this? I got this. Out over the rocks. Zap them. Genius. Curse of the tower. You know what? Fine. Oh, okay. All right, okay. I just... Having a lot of fun! Range down, sick. All stats down, hell yeah. I've lost so many stats. This is truly a challenge run. Double, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Reworked foes, making these guys a little bit more unpredictable. Nothing I can't handle, right? Oh, that's wild, that's wild! Pretty cool attack pattern, I like that. Sulfur, oh boy. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Quarter, yeah, buddy. Or a Babylon, I'm gonna just pick this up just to get rid of more red health. 
Wow. Wowie wow wowersons. I don't know what to say. Ooh, that's nice. Polar invincibility on this machine. Help me. Soul hearts are good. Soul hearts we're getting from this is amazing. All right. It lives, fight. We got here early. Good. Oh, I did not think I was going to get hit by that shot. Whoa! I don't think I've ever seen that attack pattern. Thanks, Curse the Tower, though. Cleaned it up. 6.9 damage. It's perfect. I hate this part. I hate this part of this wave. Ooh. That's a pretty good wave. That's a pretty good wave. Somewhat predictable, well telegraphed, makes you flex your skill. Good stuff. Oh my goodness. Did you guys just see that? I don't need any more evidence that this game is absolutely 100% rigged. Curse Room, the last one, potentially. Still not good. Still not good. Gimpy dropped a soul heart in there too. Ugh. Do I lose stats for jumping on the sacrifice spikes? Am I so desperate that I would do that? Did not lose stats. And Gimpy, thank you. Sacrifice spikes with the uh, wafer is just good stuff. Yep. The best. This is what genius looks like. <laughs> Oh, you suckered me into getting full red hearts and I don't have Polaroid invincibility. Or Whore of Babylon! Oh my god. I tried so hard to not lose my Polaroid invincibility in Horror of Babylon. Walk into a rune, shoot a freaking rainbow poop of all things. 5.4 damage, 3.77 fire rate. I've had Eden starts better than this. Bring it on, Super Isaac. We're doing it. No! Oh! Okay, let's find secret rooms, eh? Okay, first one's a bust. Oh my god. Ooh. Yep. Chest, please help me. Please, RN Jesus. Bless this run. Hey. All right, feeling kind of blessed. Hashtag. Insectoid shot, very, very strong. Or parasitoid, whatever it's called. We shoot out these sacks. The sacks spawn flies and spiders. Spawn hitting an enemy. We got lots of them. Wow, 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 wow. Absolute S tier item. I'm gonna beeline it for the boss here. That'll be our victory condition. Anything we do after that is extra. Here we are. IBS. Oh boy, that'll be nice. Blue baby fight. This one, I like a little bit less than the Isaac fight. Gotta admit, it's uh, it's much tougher. And like that shot right there, I don't know how I was supposed to even consider dodging it. I mean, absolutely painted into a corner. We're losing all of our stats. This part of the fight too. The swiping is so quick. I wish it was just a little bit more telegraphed and, and the shot speed could be turned down on like everything. We're just getting absolutely slaughtered. I'm getting absolutely fricked in the face. Holy moly. I don't even know what's hurting me. I, I can't even see. I can't even imagine what's going on right now. We're doing it. We're doing it. I'm doing it. I'm going to do it. Oh my God. That was a proper challenge. I took so much damage at that boss fight. Oh my lordy. Let's full clear the floor and do Mega Satan. More items, please. Oh, that's just going to really change things. He said sarcastically. Little hot, come with me. Oh, mind. Worm friend, I accept. Oh, the freaking red poop room. I'd rather fight this bloat room, this double bloat room three times more than ever have to deal with that red poop room again. Flatstone, interesting. That should proc with my compound fracture and split every bounce, right? No, okay. Still good though, maybe. No, oh, what's going on here? IBS, thank you. Five, six, six damage. That'll be good. Okay, this is actually good. Ugh. Sticky bombs and bursting sack. I'm a spider baby. All right, Mega Santa time. Once again, have had better Eden starts than this, but insectoid shot is carrying hard right now. Oh, that was nice. I think between all my flies and spot. Oh, good shot. Between the flies and spiders and my wafer, we're gonna pull out a victory here. And Gimpy Hell. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
Five, three, five damage. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, the holy poop. Save the holy poop. The angel just walked over it and ate the holy poop. Put the holy poop right in his mouth. Are these demonic angels? These look great. Makes sense for Mega Satan. Oh, come on, man. 5.0496. Below five damage, baby. That's all I like to fight Mega Satan. Oh, IBS, you're not making this more easy on me here. Dodging master over here, though. Ooh! <laughs> we did it! We flippin' did it. Let's fight Delirium. It'll be fine. Wiggle Worm, tears up. All stats up, I mean. We should probably pick the boss rooms that we know are not going to be Delirium first. Although I don't like the idea of having to fight more rooms to get there. Golden chest. I was looking for like maybe like a plus 10 damage. Let me know if you come across one of those. I could use it. These boss rooms in this corner down here can't be Delirium. The boss room here on the side also cannot be Delirium. If you were to plop down a two by two room, it would collide with the other rooms, giving it more entrances so it wouldn't work. Oh well, yeah, speed up is in all stats. Scatter bombs, horrible, horrible idea. Whoa, Gish rework. Oh! Oh my god, the bombs! Holy cluster bombs. Hey, Guppy's paw. That makes sense for us to just go or a Babylon mode. So these boss rooms down here also cannot be Delirium. Actually, the one on the right could be if you put the two by two room bottom right. So this one first, and then the rest of the three could possibly be Delirium. Hot bombs. Okay, we have a bomb build. That's okay by me. All right, don't be Delirium. It's not. Let's drop a bomb in there, see what happens. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Made short work of Isaac. Holy smokes. For tear detonator. Um, yeah. Yeah, that seems good. Look at that. Cool. Second to last boss room. This one is delirium. It's time, y'all. Let's go. Probably should be dropping more bombs. Just leaving all these fires around the map. I think it's going to be a good idea. We're about a third of the way, I'd say. I haven't gotten hit yet, I don't think. Uh oh. Halfway. Dude, we're so gonna do this. Two thirds. What's this pill doing in here? <laughs> All right, we're finally taking damage. We're doing such a good job though. Completely carried by my spiders and flies and the bomb damage. Oh, my tear detonator, I forgot. Should be using that more. It's so good. It's over, dude. It's over. How did we manage to defeat Delirium? Complete carry by our items. Wow, what a challenge. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Did you like this run? Don't forget to check out some of the live streams. We are now streaming on Twitch and YouTube. We have some brand new emotes to show off. Thank you for being an awesome supporter. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Welcome back to this stupid mod, Bale. Some of you were like, oh, it's the coolest mod I've ever seen. You have to make more of this. I'll never say I never did nothing for you. If you missed the last episode, go watch it. But also, as Bale, the pools are flooded with over 50 cursed cat items. The cat insists you must take every free item you see. Luckily, you're provided with free dice shards in every treasure room. Yeah, these two images pretty much sum it up.